and squares. Just, yeah, just yeah, yeah, squares. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Disco ball lights. No, we didn't, didn't go No, classes. no, they were on him. Yeah. They it, were behind him, shining yeah, on the house. It was so, classy. Right. It was a classy affair. Yeah, but yeah. it's the typical, you know, you're at, picture, typical wedding. This was what you get. Uh, the people are wonderful and everything else. Except, I, I, I'm i not dancing. Did well, so you right, do the chicken dance even? Uh, no. I, I, I would watch. So that was this, the only typical thing he didn't do. Well, we didn't say the whole time. Maybe they might have gotten into that True, later. true enough. Dollar so, dance. The, uh, there's this one guy there. Who every time a song would start, and he's in a t-shirt and jeans, a little bit overweight, looked like uh, sort of a Kevin James type body, and he's dancing, he's a pretty good dancer, and he's dancing with this lady who's decked out, she looks great, and they evidently showed up together, and he had some weird jean jacket on, and he'd take that off, and the sweat stains on his back, and his pits were there, because he was a little bit, he's not chicken, but he's dancing, he's enjoying, he'd wipe his forehead off, he'd go sit down. And, we're, and I'm like right next to the dance floor. I'm not getting on that thing. I just I always found it strange at weddings that if in fact you stood up next to your table and said this song's got me and you started dancing, people would think you're crazy. But if you took two steps to the right and stood on the wood, totally Very acceptable celebrated. behavior. Like if I was like next to the table and I'm like I'm just dancing here. Is that all right? What's wrong with him? Something's wrong with him. He won't stand on the wood and do that. And he's for, he's, he's not even on the wood. So I just I I marvel at white people dancing. So everybody's dancing and stuff. This guy's going, and then another lady. And a red dress moves in, and she starts dancing with Kevin James. The sweaty t-shirt jeans, Kevin oh, James. Oh, he's And I'm like, this guy's dance moves are swinging some serious heat. Well, what it turns out is, the blonde lady broke up with her boyfriend the day before. And said, my backup plan's here. We found, found all this yeah, gossip. How do you get in this? Really? Oh, because I'm talking to the other ladies that don't dance. You're talking with the girls that don't... I'm talking to all the women that don't get uh, that whose husbands don't care for them. <laughs> And I'm like, oh, what's going on here, ladies? Who's this cat? She goes, nobody knows who he is. I'm like, he's got some supreme confidence to go into an entire room where he doesn't know anybody and just start and, and up. own the dance floor. I'm like, that's impressive. I got to get a good job. He's kind of one of the... Then his name tag was the wrong name because it was supposed to be that other, other girl's guy. boyfriend. So he's a wedding crasher almost. Sort of, but he was invited. So this other lady goes over and she starts dancing. She dumped her husband six days ago. She starts going oh, dancing. Oh yeah. Her. So the blonde lady and the lady in the dress start dancing together and they're looking at each other like, what are you doing with the fat guy? That's my rivals. And they start going. So then she moves in between, the other one moves in between. They start going back and forth and now it's battle for the fat guy, which only happens in Waddell, Arizona. <laughs> battle for the fat guy goes on and he is just on it. Then all of a sudden, someone who is not blonde or not in the red dress comes over in Kevin James ear and Kevin James puts his head down and sits down and never gets back up and dances again and I'm trying to figure this out so the two ladies one at a time come over to Kevin James and start making their move now I'm right next to this so I'm sitting there trying to listen all I can so this what are you guys together or what happened she's trying to mine information out of were you cheating with her while she was with the boyfriend to, to make him like Say, oh, no, 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 I'm a free agent. I can't possibly. I'm not in a relationship with her because evidently that was something. And the other one's you have like, a chart or something? It was great. It was amazing. It was amazing soap opera behavior. Scouting. She was scouting. So, yeah, she was basically saying, if, in fact, you're with her and it's exclusive tonight, that means you two were together before she broke up. And I'm going to tell everybody. Is what it felt like. Is that was a fight almost happened was? Yes. And so then, so I'm thinking, good, wedding fight. I haven't seen one. I've been in weddings that I've had fights and I left early and I didn't. And you were on the outside of a big fight. Uh, huge. But I, yeah, nothing ever occurred. This one was ready to go. And then the girl in the red dress snapped up all her stuff and stormed out. Fat guy Kevin James had two ladies. One of them looked great. The other one was freshly divorced and on the prowl. Ready to just pound ass, like right there. And fat guy Kevin James got talked to. You need to sit down and shut the F up. You're ruining someone's wedding. No one knows who you are. And he did. But he just sat and sweat in that chair. And I'm like, oh, so now all I can think about is what happened? Right. Did he bang the blonde one? Was yeah, he banging he was her old. before? I need, to go back to, bang I need to go back to what? You need one of those Arizona. videos. One yeah. of those videos of the wedding reception. Yes. Or we'll see something going on. But yes, something brewed. And it was, it's been on my mind since we left. And of course, there was hours of dancing. And there was chicken and noodles. And a woman in a dress and a sweaty groom. And the typical, just drop, drop wedding here. But it was lovely. It was a nice thing. And then a softball team. The softball team he coaches danced, practiced and danced for... Uh, it's just a good thing Larry Nasser wasn't there. Let's just say oh, that. Man. It was a bunch of 16-year-old girls. And Dr. Larry Nasser would have had to leave that because... They, uh, they did a, a dance for the coach, and I'm like, well, 